Hello. So, for about a year now, um, I've slowly been having an increasing problem with Aptasia. Um, I've tried a whole number of different ways to get rid of it, uh, using the usual chemicals. Um, I've tried hot dips. Um, I've tried water changes. I think what I found is Aptasia are really, really persistent. Um, and I've actually come to respect them as as organisms. Um, the fact that they can produce spores that enable them to, if the parent organism dies, to continue. Um, the fact that they can resist chemicals, they can resist heat, they can resist light. I mean, people have tried to burn them out with lasers and yet they still come back. So, this has actually forced me to accept their presence in my tank and, and stop trying to fight it. Um, uh, there, there are three things here. Um, from knowledge we gain wisdom and if we focus that wisdom and knowledge um, we can come up with a solution and that's what I've tried to do um, because if I don't do anything but because it's a closed environment uh, that the tank will, will descend into chaos the chaos of, of Aptasia just being everywhere. And there, there are certain fish um, that are said to eat Aptasia because what I'm looking for now is, is a natural route to solving this problem. Um, and as I said, there's certain fish that eat Aptasia. There's certain invertebrates. Um, the peppermint shrimp is, is said to eat Aptasia, but it, they're, they're very hit, hit or miss. Um, and then I came across something uh, that no, I haven't seen many people try. Um, and that is um, an invertebrate called a Bergia. Now this is a slug that solely feeds on Aptasia. Now these guys, uh, for what they are, they're not cheap. Um, but I did find um, a um, fish store that was selling them. And I, I bought a couple. I thought I'd give it a go. And I think this is going to be successful. Because it is a form of finding a balance. And the balance is that I can now accept Aptasia being in my aquarium, but I have organisms that will keep them under control so I don't experience chaos. And I am expecting to experience harmony. Yeah.